Alright you guys, what is going on? Welcome. Welcome back to the final update of the Major Key Physique 6 week fat loss challenge. What the fuck is that? That's... Oh, that's just water. Don't worry about that. Um, so here we are. You know this channel is all about being transparent, it's all about being open, honest. So the first thing I'm going to do is show you guys the date. If I can somehow get it up here. The date. Tuesday the 10th of April, it is 9.43 in the morning and I am about to take my final measurements. This morning I went down to the gym, I had my final weigh-in. No food, no water, I was flat as fuck to be honest because I did deplete myself quite a bit yesterday just to get that final weight down which is what you can do. So this morning I weighed in at 91 kilos on the dot which is a brand new low and in fact that is that's pretty much the lowest I've weighed in 18 months. Before I started the Making Gain series, I'd weighed 89 kilos. At the peak of my bulk, I got up to 105. At the start of this six week cut, I was 99.1. Now six weeks later, I'm down at 91 kilos. So that is a total weight loss of 8.1 kilo, which is amazing in my books. I mean, that, that is a result, and that is the result of sticking to a plan and trusting the process, and that's exactly what I've been doing. Now we get to the fun part. You guys have seen this before. So this is where I've been tracking my measurements. There's three things that are completely and absolutely essential to any transformation, guys. That is taking your weight, which I've done. That is taking your measurements, which I'm about to do. And that is taking progress pictures. I've taken my final set of progress pictures. Now we have four sets. We've got one on day one, we've got one on day 14, we've got one on day 28, and we've got our final set today on day 42, which marks six weeks. So, so right now I'm gonna show you guys my final transformation pictures. I took them this morning. This is no food, no pump, 91 kilos. Like I keep saying, one from the front, one from the side, one from the back, and one from the other side. So I've kept my progress pictures completely uniform. I've had the exact same lighting, I've had the exact same camera, same same place, and that has provided me with some awesome pictures to now promote this six week transformation, which is exactly why I've been doing this, guys. I wanted to show you what was possible in six weeks with the plan that you trust and follow through with. And here we are. So, so you guys are gonna to have to trust me. I've got my tape measure. I'm gonna take all of my measurements. We've got neck, shoulders, chest, waist, left arm, right arm, left thigh, right thigh, left calf, right calf. So that is a total of 10 measurements. I'm gonna get those done and I'll be back here in just a minute. Or maybe not a minute, but a neck minute. So I've got the results here. Once again, draft, draft copy. We're gonna put the final results in the fourth column, which I cannot wait to do, and then we're going to see exactly what the differences are from day one to day 42. is done. Can you see the happiness on my face? <laughs> I just want a cheat meal to be fair. Like I am quite flat right now, um, but I did that for a reason to try and bring my weight down. But what that does do is really deplete the glycogen out of your system, out of your muscles. And so, you know, what I would say is that I am, I'm in a bit of a flat depleted state right now. So these measurements are completely accurate. I've been in this exact state the, the entire time, no pump, you know, first thing, first thing in the morning, um, and that is what I would expect my clients to do too. So, here we are, the final results. <clears throat> I can't believe it. Six weeks has flown by, guys, I'm not going to lie. Here we are. So, as I talk through these, I'm going to put a little screenshot down in the corner so you guys can uh, roll through them with me. So, neck. See, my neck... <laughs> Well, if it did, it, apparently it had an inch, inch and a half of fat on there before. 
Now it certainly doesn't. My neck is lean as fuck. <laughs> but anyways, day one, my neck was at 17 inches. We've lost an inch and a half. Today it is 15.5. Shoulders started at 53.25 inches. In those first two weeks, I lost a lot of my fullness and, it, and they went down to 51 inches. In the next two weeks, it actually increased by a quarter of an inch, but today we're down again to 50.5. So that is a total loss of 2.75 inches around my shoulders. Around my chest, we started at 47. Today we're at 45.5, so that is a loss of 1.5 inches. Waist, 36. After two weeks, it was 34.5. After another two weeks, it was 33.5. And I told you guys I was going to try my absolute very best to try and get it down to 32 inches by the end of this. Well, it's 32 point something. It's 32.75. So that's a total loss of 3.25 inches, which is the biggest loss of any body part, which is exactly how I wanted it to happen. You want your waist to come in. You want everything else to stay the same, or except a, at least a guy who has muscle mass does. Right up, my left arm and right arm pretty much tracked you know, the exact same way, it started at 16.5 inches, down to 16.3, 16.25, and today, in the, you know, relatively flat state that I am, they're at 16 inches. So, if we're looking at my thighs, you know, I've actually put the, uh, the data on the wrong leg, so my left thigh is actually the value for my right thigh. So, I've been dealing with a little bit of an injury on my left leg, which has prevented me from training legs heavy over these six weeks. So my left thigh is the one that's injured, has lost an inch. It started at 25.5 inches and now it's 24.5. My right thigh started at 25.5 and now it's down to 25. So we've lost an in, uh, half an inch my right thigh. I am still, you know, I'm still not completely sure about what's going on with my leg, but all I do know is that I can hamstring curl, I can leg extension, but anything that gets me down in the pocket to do with squats or leg press, it feels like it's gonna go, it feels like it's gonna snap. So I've taken it easy on legs. The final measurement is calves, and you know, I was pretty confident that I wasn't gonna lose any size in my calves. I hadn't trained calf for two years, and I'd lost half an inch. So at the start of this six week transformation my calves were at 15.5 inches. Today they are still at 15.5 inches and that my friends is the six week Major Key Physiques Fat Loss Transformation Challenge done. <sighs> what a relief. <laughs> so I want to say I want to say that anyone looking at changing their physique but just lacking the motivation, lacking the drive, lacking the, you know, lacking that, that, that one thing that sort of, you know, just sparks it, you know, it pulls the pin, it's like, right, I, I need to do this and I'm going to because I really want to for these particular reasons, whatever they are. So if anything, I want you guys to get out of the series that it's possible, anything's possible, you've just got to start like I did on day one. Can you imagine how I felt after one week, you know, not really progressing too much, thinking I've got five weeks to go? Yeah, you can get down on yourself, but I always like to say, don't count the days, make the days count, all right? And every single day of these 42 days, yes, I would, I would give a small thought to the amount of work that I had to be done, but for the remainder of the day, I was focusing on that one day and, you know, dieting as, as best I could, making sure I got my training in, if I was going to do cardio, making sure that's done and going to sleep every night feeling content with what I've done on that day without having to worry too much about all the work that is to come. So here we are, that's how I've got through every single day of these 42 days and that is how I would advise my clients to get through them. But for now, I've talked way too much. I wanna invite you guys to watch my next video which is going to cover the entire transformation. I'm gonna look at all of my pictures. I am going to talk about my dieting strategies and I'm gonna talk about macros and, and everything like that. Everything that I did in detail to bring myself down from 99 to 91 kilos in six weeks. So if you're looking forward to that, stick around. 
If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. If you like the video or you like the transformation, give it a like. And I'll see you guys in the next one.